everybody. Well, for me to do it last tomorrow, man, that'd be like my third job, bro. I'm like I'm working like a goddamn to me. Third job. DoorDash, UPS, Kroger, music, acting. Damn, fuck I don't do in this bitch. Going to UPS right now. Hope I make it on time though, bro. Shit. This is that beat, bro. I ain't buy the I ain't buy the rights to it yet. Want the license? The license it. Do DJ Payne one? Nigga be at them all that shit with the hooks on there, bruh. Then there a girl I want to write a song about. <clears throat> and that's what this shit gonna be about. It's gonna be about her. She might be surprised I wrote it. Maybe. Gotta like her. I wanna get at her. I wanna get at her. Cause I'm a Virgo and she a Leo. I love Leo's. I think I think I'm attached and addicted to Leo's. Hey, you wrong. Man, boy, this shit sit just so fucking perfect, bro. Without the core put in that motherfucker, bro. And my phone wanna sit all pretty and shit. Ain't that some shit? Doordash tomorrow. Get this extra money, bro. And then I die. Then my mama or my sister gonna go with me because they used to the shit already. So when I do this shit and like the shit, hopefully I ain't not liking it. If I ain't not liking the shit, just going around my neighborhood, Milford, Clayton County, delivering food and shit. I'm gonna fuck with them. I'm gonna rock with that, bro. I'm gonna rock with it, bro. And get the order, up? bro. It's your boy Drizzy Drake, and you are now rocking. God damn, do that shit tomorrow. And I work Kroger tomorrow, uh, Thursday. And then I'm gonna do a shit again Friday. The Kroger got me off Friday. And I'm gonna do a shit again Saturday. Sunday be a chill day, cause I gotta go do my fitting for my uh, acting role in the Rail series called The Chronicle. I still haven't studied my shit yet, so I gotta start studying that shit. I only got six lines, so I need to study the shit. Good shit though. Then after I'm done with the real series, next year gonna be a good fucking year for me, buddy. Cause next year I will be trying to goddamn perform. Y'all look for that shit, bro. Not the hustle, real be performing it full at the fuck over my show, but AR be at. I don't care if I ran my whole goal there at the network. Same right, I've been networking now. I network little, with a little by route. And shit, cause I saw a post that he posted about he, uh, Start from own artists, independent artists and shit. So I ran on that look at the shit. So soon I would have him promoting for me. I probably cough him up a good thousand, maybe. I don't know, he didn't tell me a price. But real shit, if you're an independent artist, you got some checks, thousand dollars in your pocket. Holla at Bow Rod, man. You might be able to put you on your platform, man, and promote you and support you. When you get when you get him telling you got down, he like your sound, bruh. That was up, bro. But that mean, bro. That mean I did that shit. Not the hustle of that motherfucking song. A lot of y'all might feel like nope, it ain't, nigga. To not the hustle of that song. So I fuck with not the hustle. So I fuck with it. Cause I'm not gonna lie, it's not the hustle. 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 What's up? It's your boy, I did my thing on that song. With you know, man, so. But, I'm just not that type of artist neither. I ain't gonna say I like to rap about everything. Uh, I think my uh, whole thing like rapping about my life. It was beat by DJ Payne, one that I haven't bought yet, but I'm planning on buying it. Buying the beat. Uh, Got a hook on there. Gotta do the hustle. And uh, I like the song, bro. So I fuck around, came over my own little dance to the shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I ain't finna tell y'all how to dance. Go, but simple as shit, dance simple as shit. 
dancing but shit, man. Like I'm not finna tell y'all how to do the hustle. How to do the hustle yet, man. So when I buy that beat from DJ Payne One, yes sir. I'ma have everybody doing the hustle. You know what I mean, cause like I said, I feel like, you know, just like Tupac. Tupac was with Digital Underground. He was dancing for Digital Underground before he became a big star in rap. That's just to show you that Tupac was different. You know what I mean? Tupac wasn't just that gangster rap person that y'all know of. Tupac wasn't just that hit him up. That he, uh, this big and small. He wasn't just that person. He wasn't just the keep your head up. He was more than that, man. He was more than that. So my whole goal there today is, man, you know, uh, now I'm on the Indie Bible. I'm, I finally made it to the H's, letter H, with the Indie Bible. So I'm going to be hearing up them playlists today when I finally make it back home from UPS. And after I do that, like I say, planning it to work like crazy today, man. Like I can't stop. Planning it today to go ahead and do a video for Not The Hustle. Go ahead and do a video for... Uh, Front of the green screen, go and do a video for go and do a video for uh rock right now. A lot of people like the song right now. I suppose did a video for that. So people might be looking at me like nigga, why the hell you ain't dropped that shit yet? I ain't did a video yet for right now. So right now we'll be coming soon on YouTube. Not the hustle will be coming soon on YouTube. You know, man, I just like drop music, man. I think for now on I might do a video for every song I drop. Just because I can. I got the green screen, you feel me? You either like it or don't like it, you feel me? Shit, yeah, so, the level I'm gonna be working toward, y'all gonna like it, I'm gonna like it. And me doing all this shit myself, I gotta go back, edit everything, put it. all the pictures, all the moving videos. The fuck they probably walking slow for, bruh? Move, uh, moving video in the back, the screen of the uh, green screen. All that type of shit. I do all this shit, man. I video, I argue for myself. I work two jobs. Now I'm about to work door day. That'll, that'll be my third job, like a Jamaican. So I'm, I'm officially a Jamaican because I like work. Like, I love to work. I like to get money. I love money. You know what I mean? I feel like if you ain't got no money, then you can't go out on a date with no female. If you ain't got no money, you can't got that. Do what you need to do with music. If you ain't got money, you can't got to take your car to get a fit. So I'm doing it, but ever and the mean necessary to do what the fuck I need to do, bro, to keep going and keep flowing at the end of the day. It's not bad. Yeah. You know, man, so shit. So that's my thing, bro. Somebody just told me not bad. That means somebody check out not the hustle. I make. Yes, sir. That's right, bro. So I work. What I do, bro. I work. I'm a normal motherfucking nigga who do music in the day, bro. I work two jobs. About to start DoorDash tomorrow in Atlanta. You feel me? In Atlanta, Georgia. Make some extra money because Kroger got me off tomorrow. Cut down my house. So now I got to hustle do some other shit. Then on top of that, Byra said he want to promote me. I know that shit got to come with money. So he told me that shit yesterday. Little Byra told me that shit yesterday that he don't mind from on my ass. I got busted. I got to come with some type of bag. So if I had to guess a bag... I guess I'd rather have like a thousand dollars in my motherfucking hand. Y'all tell y'all tell me how much money y'all think an independent artist like myself that work a normal job that y'all think Barry are looking for to promote my music. I want everybody to answer that right now. Whoever on here, I don't I say I got two people on here. I want y'all to answer that. Do y'all think Barry need what? Need about a thousand dollars for my for my pocket, from my hand to promote my music? Or do y'all think he might need like maybe five hundred likes? Some money so he could do something with it. You know what I mean? Cause Bye Bye Rich ass nigga at the end of the day, of course. But of course, of course, man, this ain't no goddamn, this ain't no damn uh, frisbee needle, you feel me? I found out with, with that music shit, you gotta invest every dollar, every cent in yourself at the end of the day. Or you can already try to get signed to a fucking major label and get screwed. I bet. Shit, I'm ready to hit you up when I get off from work later on tonight. When I think about it, shit, just go ahead and DM me. So I, so I can remember. Go ahead and check my DM when I get off from work. And all that type of stuff. So I might forget. And then, you know, on this last shit. You know, sometimes this shit got damn it out on and on. For some type of fucking reason. 
But yeah, so Bow Wow like he want the uh he doing some promotion for independent artists, upcoming artists. I like damn. Hey bet. Shit. Work, bro. That's what I do, that I work. The grind do not stop for me. Fell asleep yesterday in my bedroom, but today I would not be in my bedroom today. My main goal is to go. My main goal would be to go uh, make it home, hang up my clothes, hang up my clothes, make sure my room is straight in my house. I do have my own townhouse that I own. Make sure that shit's straight. Make sure that after that I will be in the studio working after that. I will not be watching no TV today. Probably be drinking on some green tea. Maybe some green tea and shit tonight. Maybe some green tea tomorrow morning. Keep me going, keep me flowing for the door that ass shit. Keep me, make sure I keep me a bottle of water. A bottle of water in the motherfucking car hall. Huh? So man, doing the door that ass shit. Gotta keep hydrated, man. Work, my nigga. No game, no play. Work. So from the door that shit, I make some money, bro. That OV. My plan is still work, bro. Even when I'm not at work. Period. But when the acting shit come on, man, they tell me when they need me to be there, then bro, I gotta be there. Had the acting shit. Probably right after I get off from UPS. Go to do my shit, do my line, do my shit. Boom, boom, boom. Then fuck around and get out of there. Or whatnot. Hey, I got to be on repeat, man. I'm, I'm gonna write to this shit soon. Write to this shit. I ain't, I ain't about to fucking beat for it yet. DJ Payne One, man, he be having some hot shit with the hooks on there, man. Nobody fuck with DJ Payne One, man. That's like my main producer go to when it comes down to hooks. Beach the hooks on there, man. A lot of his shit. Sign them, but hits. Like, do the hustle. I'm gonna make a dance to that shit. Y'all nigga gonna be thinking I'm Soldier Boy. <laughs> Y'all nigga gonna be thinking, nigga, I've had the goddamn hit a playlist for Soldier Boy for that shit. Like, literally, bruh. Like, the grind don't fucking stop, bruh. I grind every motherfucking day, nigga. Work hard every motherfucking day. If I ever have a fucking late shit, who motherfucking knows, bruh? I can't even tell that shit. Life is a bit. Grind, my nigga. What's up? This your boy, Jesus. Like, when well, my homeboy have a club down here in Atlanta, bruh. You got his club, bruh. You tell me that shit, bruh. He like, sir. But you gotta grind, dog. You gotta grind, get it, bro. You gotta get that money. Like, damn, what the fuck you mean by that? What the fuck you mean? I gotta goddamn grind, nigga. But you gotta grind. Like, damn, bro, really? Sport on the motherfucking bunch. Get the goddamn sport. But nah, though, man, work, man. Let me tell y'all like this, man. Tell y'all like this, bro. You keep grinding, bro. You got a dream, you got a goal, bro. You got to work for that shit. Same way, same way you can wake up tomorrow, bro, and be like, you want a house. Yeah, what? To get that house, bro, you got to work for that shit. You ain't got nobody to give you a house or leave you a house after they gone and dead. Then, bro, you gotta work to get that shit. Everything else, you gotta work for it at the end of the day. And usually, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm working for everything. Now, now I'm working for to have the cheat ego and have money put in my pocket, my bank account, so I be able to cheat and invest into my career like I want to invest at, at the end of the day. A good example. Uh, Tyler Perry. I think he paid for. I think he paid out here own money. I think it was something he paid out here own money. You know, for his, his first gig. Real shit though. Sometimes, bro, shit, that's what it is, man. You gotta pay your rate, bro. They like these Spotify playlists. So, you know, goddamn record label, all they do is do pay your. 
All they do is pay Yoda. All they do is goddamn pay the radio station and play your song, make your shit hot as a hit to get placement on the radio station and promote your music. Don't you know, goddamn record label, all they do is pay Yoda on Spotify and get your shit hot on Spotify. Do y'all know that? But I mean, y'all didn't know that shit. But there's some artists out here really giving a gem of what the labels do. Bruh, that, that, that right there's a good guy right there. That nigga, that nigga Rush give out gym like a motherfucker, bro. Niggas don't even really know. Record label pay money to get nigga hot on the fucking Spotify. Nigga don't know, nigga goddamn pay what good, boy. Niggas don't know that goddamn record label pay money to get a nigga hot on the radio. Pay Yola. Then motherfucker goddamn be looking like, oh, Spotify, this playlist on Spotify want me to pay 50 bucks. Oh, this Spotify playlist want me to pay goddamn $200, nigga. Record label do the same motherfucking thing, my nigga. Shit, nigga, you want to goddamn get hot on Spotify playlist, nigga, work, nigga, grind. Grind to fucking get your money up to goddamn invest in that shit. Oh, yeah, bro, I'm going to be doing DoorDash tomorrow, my nigga. <laughs> DoorDash. That nigga, but that nigga, might say, well, nigga, goddamn, bro, you trying to work like a goddamn Jamaican. I'm trying to get that money. Be doing DoorDash tomorrow by guy. DoorDash in tomorrow. All right, bro. Hey, yeah, I'll make sure I hit your line up, bro. It might not be right now. I'm here to, I'm here to, to work. And right now, I'm on live and shit. So, I'm trying to make it to work. I'm trying for me to go in. And then, too, bro. I'm trying to get the money, too, bro. Just in case, but a little shot at him on the... Something on the tongue, too, bro. It might be like she like on a date. And, you know, I can't have no broke pockets. <laughs> I can't have no broke pocket, my guy. I bet, bro. I got you. I'm hit you up when I get off. Yeah, yeah, bro. That my guy. Damn, I don't want to say like best friend and that no shit, man. Man should never say nothing about no best friend. But that nigga like my goddamn corn, like my goddamn roll dog, bro. Nigga, when that nigga ever get married, bro, I'm gonna be right there here red and like that my boy. Nigga finally getting married. Yeah, but all we trying to do, man, we all trying to find somebody going to be there for us, man, for our dream. When we make it succeed, there's somebody going to be there, you feel me? Really, I'm looking for me a female, bro, to get me out my fucking element, bro. Like, I be so fucking busy working and shit. Lately, I don't really be having no time for goddamn fun. A lot of time to have fun, but some places to have fun, you got to have some money. Shit. Could take a female to the park and shit, but nah though, but the one who I'm talking to right now, like I said, I am a musician at the end of the day. Outside of working, my two jobs or three jobs or whatever the fuck it about to be. Nah, I mean I do I am looking for somebody who I can uh you know get to know, talk to for a minute. You know what I mean? So hopefully that it her. I feel I feel just like Nipsey Hussle, man. I remember Nipsey Hussle said that. He found Lauren London on the ground. Shit. Word. So shit, maybe goddamn there is somebody I do want to talk to that be on the ground. I'm just trying to get her cause like, eh. It's like I'm trying to pull her in, but she not mm -mm. let me pull her in, you feel me? So I'm just letting her know like shit. Let her know, like, baby shit. You don't need no man who's gonna abuse you. Abuse you and shit. You need somebody who's gonna love you, and then she's gonna say she crazy. <laughs> I said, shit, bro. I love me a woman who's crazy. But, sometimes, some females, not all of them, but some females, niggas make them crazy. Because the shit that they fucking do, bro, like, they don't understand, nigga, man. You got a good woman, man. You need a goddamn make sure she. Be there for her, nigga, no matter what, through her ups and her motherfucking down at the end of the day. I'm just not learning this shit because I'm older at, older at the end of the day. I'm older now, so, like, I'm 32. So, shit, that type of shit I'm looking for. I'm looking for somebody to be 
down for me to move through my ups and downs. Yeah, you know I mean, if I'm down, baby, shit, pick me right, pick me right back. God damn, some smoke. You know, pick me right back up. Hate these cars that we got down smoking, bro. Like, bro, they got down smoking. Coming strings. Okay. Truck get smoke. Got smoke coming from his pipe. Motherfucker. Hate that goddamn smell, bro. Don't y'all just hate nigga when you driving behind a goddamn truck and nigga goddamn driving and all of a sudden the goddamn smoke come from the pipes and then you can smell that shit. What's up, bitch? Right behind that shit. Hey, niggas, bro. What's up, Rich? Right now, I'm just driving to work right now, here to work. At the end of the day, bro, that's my Monday through Friday type of day. Here to work, going to work. Trying to make it to work, going to be late. They have been getting on my ass about that shit. Sometimes we hope they had just send my black ass home sometime. Hey. And the fuck going on right here? Shit. Man, this shit better not have no goddamn fucking. I don't trying to let you go back at. Damn it. Yeah, man. man so shit. Right now, that one doing going to work. Up, bro. I'm going back to by the beats. I've been got down. Spoke rain too with DJ Payne one. I fuck with DJ Payne one shit. Like I say he got a lot of hits on his shit. A lot of hits. A lot of beats got hits. I got so many beats from people, man. I got beat from niggas like DJ beat my partner in crime. We supposed to be working on some shit, produce some shit together. Having Kane, cause he busy guy. Like I say, he work. I work. We still trying to do music at the same time, bro. So that shit. Oh dear, collaboration with my girl Hummy the Bliss. She both came over Larry, but like I say, you are now with I don't really got down work and do shit, bro. Like, shit, if I hit you up and you don't hit back, and then you hit back later, bro, I gotta know the car, bro, and just fuck it. You know, so. I mean, so it's like work, bro. You gotta stay working, man. Stay grinding. Never let nobody goddamn take you out your element, bruh, and tell you this and that and all that type of shit. He grinding out there. He grinding and getting it. Hey, what the fuck going on down here, man? Oh, it's a fucking trap.
and trap it in this bitch. If I have time tomorrow, I got the goddamn. I got the fuck around and uh, hey, fuck around, get my store together, my uh, my Shopify store together. I ain't even get money, bro. Get money, get money around my mouth. Shit, I'm not planning on just sending my ass around. Shit, if bro gonna give me my vacation for next week, oh boy, going down. Be door dash like a motherfucker, bro. Door dash on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Then take a chill pill Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Later, right? I get off the work. 